We are on our fourth day trip in Bangkok, Thailand, and we will explore the Chiang Mai, north of Thailand. We are going there to visit the Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort. Please note that there is no direct flight from Philippines to Chiang Mai. If you will be coming from Singapore and you want a hassle-free side trip, you can directly fly to Chiang Mai. Wanabung Airport, we took a 7 a.m. flight via Air Asia going to Chiang Mai. After 1 and 15 minutes travel by plane, we arrived in Chiang Mai. Chiang Mai is the largest city in Northern Thailand. From late November through the mid-February are the cooler months to be in Chiang Mai. And it starts to warm from mid-February onward. Today, March 5, 2024, we are going to the jungle in Tawan River Elephant Resort. Transportation going to the resort will be arranged by them. The driver will pick you up. He was holding a signage with my name on it when we arrived. You will be instructed which gate you will exit. It was a very hassle-free travel. The is located near Mei Wang National Park, 50 kilometers south of Chiang Mai. If you book a full-day visit excursion for at least two adults in Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort, the transport from and to Chiang Mai City or Chiang Mai Airport is free. Full-day visit includes meet the elephants and feed them, walk in the jungle with the elephants, elephant bathing in the river, bamboo rafting, small walk, and picnic at the waterfall. Will they visit finish at around 3 p.m.? It's up to the guests if you want to go back to the city or if you want to stay overnight at the resort. After 45 to 50 minutes drive, we arrive in Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort. Weather at the time is cooler than we thought. It was 16 degrees centigrade. I was wondering why Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort and Elephant Friends has the same entrance. Our guide said these two own by the same company. You can pay everything upon arrival. They also accept credit card. We will be staying here one night and two days. We book a family room good for five. It costs 3,899 baht. Since our check-in time is 2 p.m., we can start our full day tour while waiting for our room to be ready. Our first activity to be done is bamboo rafting. You should dress in swimsuit or a comfortable outfit like a t-shirt or a pair of shorts so that you will not have to feel very stuffy when you get wet. In case you forget to bring your dry bags, they will provide free waterproof bags so you can put all your electronic device, your cash and other valuable things so they will not be damaged by the water. Now entering the Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort, which is nestled inside a jungle. Do not forget sunscreen, eyeglasses, head cups because although in the morning the temperature can be cold, you cannot escape the heat from the afternoon sun. This ride will bring us off to the starting point of our bamboo rafting. Wang River is a shallow river, is the perfect spot for a trip in bamboo rafting. Only three guests per boat is allowed, plus the driver. Sailing along the clear and cold water of the Maywang River, it gives me a relaxing feeling, being immersed in the middle of the natural atmosphere. This is the most relaxing 40-minute ride I had in my whole life.
boat ride ends just in front of Tawan Riverside Restaurant. After the bamboo rafting, we meet our guide. He can speak English and we learn a lot from him. They gave us free water to drink before we start our next activity which is meet the elephants and feed them. According to our guide, feeding them requires 250 kg of corns, bananas, and other fruits per day for an adult elephant. It is an extraordinary experience to interact with these gentle giants. In ideal world, all elephants would be free in nature. However, due to human population increases and habitat destruction, the reality is that there is not enough appropriate habitat to support current wild population of Asian elephants. Before I visited Tawan Riverside, I read their website and it says, to clarify some points to avoid misunderstanding, according to them, they have 13 elephants, meaning they eat more two tons of food every day. All their elephants are captive animals for tourist use and the activities they offer are the best solution to have feed them 250 kg per day for an adult elephant. They also explain that they don't have the means to build sufficiently large and resistant enclosure so they have to chain them after 4.30 p.m. so we don't let them roam free for security reasons. Despite this constraint, they give the most pleasant environment to the animals. The first thing is to ban the riding with cradles. Second is to leave them in semi-liberty as much as possible during the day without chains. And the third is to offer suitable activities for their well-being. So once in a lifetime experience, hiking with these gentle giants. Hour off to the river to bathe the elephants. Uh, elephant, hi, you had an elephant. Uh, uh, mama, mama, one, two, three. I think among all those activities with the elephants, this one is the most unforgettable. After beating the elephants, we showered keeping our wet clothes on for our next adventure which is picnic at the waterfalls. They handed us fresh clean towel and bottled water to drink. On to our last adventure of the day, our picnic lunch by the falls. This ride will take us down to the falls. It took us 15 minutes to get there. As you go down the hill and stroll down to the path, you can already hear the cascading sound of the waterfalls. You will be surrounded with the soothing sounds of nature. I think the place is not as safe as it seemed in the photos. Maybe due to the scattered huge and sharp rocks all over the place. Our guide lead us to this cottage where we could eat our packed lunch prepared by the resort. Our lunch for today, pad thai, chicken, and mixed fruits. Our lunch is pre-packed lunch from Tawan Riverside. And because we are really hungry and almost 2 p.m. in the afternoon, we order a steamed rice from that store. We order a grilled chicken and papaya salad. Aside from the mini convenience store, we also have coffee shop there that sells beers and fruit smoothies. They also have public toilets.
heading back to the resort. We are all excited to see our room to get rest. Our luggages were already there when we arrived. And now let's have a quick room tour. This is a bungalow number one. It has a terrace overlooking to the river. This is the entrance to the room. This is an air-conditioned room, good for five person. This is the toilet. Everything basic needs are here. Heater, toothbrush, and some toiletries. There's a small fridge with complimentary water to drink. There's an electric water boiler. And I find it very hygienic to find a cup covered with paper. We got a riverside view room. Initially, I wanted a mountain view room. I think they're fully booked at that time. But it doesn't matter. Anyway, this room is equally beautiful and amazing. After we freshen up, we took a power one hour nap and we can't wait to explore the place and have a good food to eat for our dinner. I wish we could stay here one more night, but we will definitely come back to this wonderful place. This place is perfect for a family trip, group of friends, even honeymooners. You can also book a photographer from them. The outside view of our bungalow. It will take you one minute walk going to the restaurant. The three restaurants in Tawan Riverside Resort. One in the Tawan Riverside proper, one in the main entrance, and one in Elephant Friends. We also found some restaurant outside the resort, just alongside the road. The main restaurant in Tawan Riverside Elephant Resort. Our complimentary buffet breakfast will be served here tomorrow. We decided to have dinner at the restaurant in Elephant Friends Resort. We learned from our guide that there is another restaurant located in Elephant Friends. He said he is one of the cook there and he invited us to try. It seems like we are passing through a narrow path to the jungle. Let's have an idea how far the place, what does the place look like. It's getting darker and we want to hurry. And wow, we are surprised how beautiful the place is. The restaurant here and the bungalows they are all facing on the beautiful mountain views. Now I know where to stay the next time we come back here. This is the view. The view is just mesmerizing. Should have come here earlier to enjoy the view. a sumptuous dinner and the food were good. We paid 2,000 baht for the five of us. This is our way back to Tawan Riverside Resort. 
Our sensor light gets to lit up every time we pass through. We'll use our handphone torch light to light our way. Thank you guys for watching. See you again on our next video of our morning wake-up call with the elephants.